On this episode of Cheesing It Up, we're making broccoli and cheddar soup. Stay tuned. We're going to start this recipe off with one stick of butter. And we're going to melt this just for a couple minutes, make sure all the butter is thoroughly melted. While we're doing that, we're going to chop one medium onion, and we're going to add that to the soup. We're going to let this cook for just about 7 to 10 minutes, just allowing it to get soft, and then we're going to add three chopped garlic cloves. Now that we added the garlic, we're going to let this cook for another five minutes or so. As you can tell, this recipe has a number of different layers, but overall, not very complex to make. Next, we're going to add one fourth cup of flour. We're going to mix it all together and cook it for another five minutes. After about five minutes, this is about what it's going to look like. While that base is cooking up, we're going to go ahead and blend up one head of broccoli, which is roughly around 10 ounces. We'll use another half head of broccoli a little bit later on. We're also going to be using a total of three carrots in this recipe, but we're only going to be blending two carrots for right now. The other carrot, we're going to hold back for garnishment later on. Now that we've finished blending up our broccoli and carrots, we can now add three cups of vegetable broth to the base. I promise this will start looking like a cream soup in a second. After adding the broth, we're going to add two and one third cups cream. Now if your soup isn't getting it thick enough, you can certainly add more cream later on, but keep in mind we're also going to be adding cheese a little bit later in this recipe. Now let's add a half a teaspoon of nutmeg, half teaspoon salt, half teaspoon pepper, and then we're going to add just one tablespoon of mustard. We're going to turn up the heat a little bit, and we're just going to let this start coming to a little bit of boil. And then once we get to a boil, we're going to start adding our carrot and also broccoli mix. Now we also want to add some additional broccoli. We have another half a head that was on the side, about five to six ounces, and we're adding that just for a little bit more texture in the broccoli soup. You're then going to mix all the ingredients together. And you're going to cook for about 30 minutes just until it gets soft. And then we're going to add the 8 ounces of shredded cheese. Cook that and stir that in for about 5 minutes. And then you're ready to serve. This last phase is certainly optional. But you can add additional cheddar cheese and also the last part of the carrot just for some extra garnishment. And until next time, keep cheesing it up.